What's up, guys? Uh, today we are going to be testing out a new deck. Welcome to Dadazard. Um, brand new deck that a friend of mine, Caleb, just suggested to me as a potential new shift tree variation with Decidueye. So he's been playing with this deck for a little while and it seemed to be doing pretty good. So I figured I'd put my little twist on it and make my own. So let's see how we do. Thanks so much for all your requests, guys. I've been getting a lot of uh, friend request battles, so those are going to be releasing as I video them, and um, I got a couple in the works. In fact, one versus my friend Caleb, who suggested this deck. So, um, again, guys, also, if there is a deck that you think is awesome and wonderful, send it to me, and I will play it on this channel and test it out to see how awesome it is. You know, let me know if there's a deck you think is just the best. Um, obviously, I have to have the cards, but... I do not mind uh, testing out decks for you guys to see how they work. You know, let me know if I'm missing something or what we're doing here. So today we are playing Learn to Pee, I believe is how you say it. So let's see how Mr. Learn does versus a all grass deck. So guys, this deck, I did put a little bit of a twist on it and I um, I took out the Dartrixes. So I'm curious to see how this is going to work with all Rowlet Decidueyes. I believe I have like three or four in here with rare candies. Um, you know, obviously you want to get, it would be ideal to get all the snipers out. That leaves you, oh, I'm sorry, leaves you about two spaces, maybe three for shift tree, depending on how many you use. I also threw in a twist that I thought might work, and that is Macargo. Oh, we're playing Metagross. This is exciting. Um, so Macargo basically using that smooth over ability to be able to get cards to the top of your deck that you want. So that'll also help get the rare candies out and also get out Ultra Balls to be able to get the desired evolutions that I need. So again, playing with two stage two decks, um, this could get a little interesting. So I'm kind of curious to see how it's going to work, but I think we'll be good at least once we start getting the flow of doing this. Now I do have obviously four. Shift tree, we have <clears throat> all the cards to be able to give you the same hand size, which um, is basically the whole point of his attack. And also, you have the two GXs, which are awesome. You have Hollow Hunt, which allows you to put three cards from your discard pile into your hand. And also, Shift Tree's GX, which allows you to um, basically take a Pokemon on the opposing side and discard it. Well, don't discard it, but shuffle it all back into his deck. So. Here we go guys, so this is kind of interesting. We need a supporter. So I think what we might do here is attach that and just go for a Cynthia straight away. So again, a lot of draw supporters in this deck because we want, oh perfect. Okay, so an Ultra Ball. And we want to hold those rare candies. So we're gonna just do this. Get ourselves, oh and I also have two Lele's in here. So we're going to Ultra Ball for Lele. Looks like we prized one. And then we are going to put this down, get our fan club for next turn. And hopefully he does not disrupt my hand in any fashion. Ideally, you probably want to hold on to that, but. Um, you know, it all depends. So guys, be pretty sweet. Now we'll be able to um, get a one Decidueye and play turn two. We'll be able to have three more guys on the bench. And um, yeah, this is looking pretty good. And he scooped, look at that already. I guess he had nothing. Um, well guys, that was quite a short video, but you know what? That is way too short. We need to try another with this Decidueye deck. I think it's going to be ideal. Um, wow, look at that. Summary. That was only three minutes. So, obviously, he wasn't getting what he wanted. Um, but, hey, that's awesome for us. So, let's see. Let's play another game. We got another chest. If you guys haven't seen my uh, chest opening video, it is pretty superb. I believe by the time this video is uploaded, it will be already uploaded. So check it out. Let's go. Game two, new Decidueye. Here we go. 
Now, originally I had played Decidueye a long time ago with um, Zorark, which was really cool because you had trade. Then I was playing around with some Decidueyes and various other guys. But um, yeah, shout out to Caleb for this awesome deck. And at the end of the um, episode, I'm going to throw up my... Uh, throw up my... Um, deck review so you can see what's in here um, not ideal to start with a slugma but you know what we're all good we got a Cynthia and what looks like a plan a Zygarde deck oh this could be interesting however they're weak to grass they're weak to my entire deck so as long as we can start setting up some uh, evolutions here Looks like he's got the Diancy. I wonder if there's buzz in here. That is the craziest card. Look at that. I just gotta discard some energy, I bet. Yep. See one energy out for this attack. Lele. Oh boy. This might be a whole different game, guys. Yep, ideal turn one Lily, here we go. <clears throat> so, how are you guys been doing on Dragon's Majesty, who uh, sent me what you've been getting. Um, a friend of mine posted an amazing video, Professor Palm Tree, go check him out. He um, opened three ETBs with Professor Banana. It was actually Professor Banana's... Um, Professor Banana's ETBs, they opened three of them at once. Got some amazing pulls, so go check out that video. Professor Palm Tree. Alright, so here we go. Let's do this. Get ourselves. We got two Lele's, alright. And we're gonna assume that next turn he is gonna sell connector. And just take a stop on that. So we want to get the fan club out to get some more basics down ASAP. And if he doesn't kill my slugma, which I think he can only do 50, so I might still be alive. And ideally, I'm gonna hold on to that to attach. Okay. Oh, but you know what? It's 50 plus. Oh, stink gonna kill my slugma well good thing I got rescue stretchers so that's ideal he is gonna be able to do some crazy damage I don't know guys this might be a real quick game so I got with Diancy that's not a bad deck I think I should try making that deck yeah this is gonna be real fast if I don't do something quick because he's already doing 150 60 70 Oh boy. Shuffle that deck up. Let's see that now. This does not look that good. I'd have to get some major, major craziness next turn. Like, what's he got? Oh, he got the baby Zygarde. Oh, Passimian. Passimian and Zygarde. Oh, this is interesting. They will be doing three matches. <laughs> Acrobike. I don't mind it, but it's unfortunate you have to discard one. It is kind of a nice. Oh, excuse me, guys. Oh, we discard a Zygarde. Interesting. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is. Oh, 
Didn't even have to do his GX. Oh boy. Well, guys, this does not look too good. I think I might have to just concede unless I get something crazy off this Cynthia. Yeah, guys, this is not good. So, unfortunately, I'm not to see that match. There's no way I was going to pull that off with um, his Zygarde being able to do 100+. plus. So, let's run through one more game, guys. I really want to show off what this deck can do. I think it's uh, a decent deck. So, here we go. Game 3, Shift Tree Decidueye. <clears throat> let's see what we got here. Oh, Water Fire. Awesome. Let's see what Silent Cow. Um, I would like to go second. Okay. Now we're talking. Let's see. No, guys, maybe I should include some nest balls in this deck. What do you think? Be able to get these basics down. Oh, looks like we're talking a Swampert Macargo deck. Interesting. Professor Kakui. What is this? Search your deck for three water energies, reel them, put them in your hand. Interesting. It's here. Water pad, water, water pad, bummer. Wow, that's horrible. Boozmas can't do anything. We're just gonna tackle. Yeah, for weakness. Oh, yeah. I don't know, guys. Getting basics out in this deck is quite difficult, it seems. Unless you have fan club. Look at this. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I am not having good luck today, guys. Wow, this is insane. With a lily. Oh, my word. Really wanted to show you with a Rotom. Oh, my. I don't know guys, maybe this deck is only good in theory, but I, I feel like it can do some damage. When it's powered though, that's the thing. Power draw. And here we go. Boom. Wow. Okay, well, you know what guys? Let's change some stuff up on this deck. I feel like I need some nest balls. So let's go do some of this real quick. We need nest balls, so let's get rid of. Don't need escape rope. Don't need ace. Well, I need ace at all. Don't need all these Cynthia's. Let's go for a nest ball. Like that. That is beautiful, isn't it? There we go. There we go. Two nest balls. Save. Yes. Yes. Okay, so guys, let's do one more game with the Sidrui Shift Tree. I feel like this deck could be really awesome. Um, when Kayla was explaining it to me, it sounded really cool. It made me break out my old Decidueyes, actually make this deck in real life. So you might see this game on a Wednesday vlog or possibly at um, <clears throat> Charizard's father. Oh, my word. Fire. This is not good either. Man, not good to have a grass deck in this format, is it? And I lost. Okay, well, I'm probably going to go second, which isn't too bad. I actually kind of like going second because that means I can evolve, so. Okay, interesting. Starting with the Lele. Well, you know what? I can't complain because I got two double colors. I could start just uh, energy driving 
while I set up my bench. I don't know how big his hand gets, I could copycat him. So let's see what he's got. Fortunately, all these guys are weak to fire. Man, I keep getting hit with the weakness today. that guy out of my ETB. Look at that. And a shrine. Oh, I forgot to put field blowers in this deck. Mercy. Let's do this. Come on, where are my nest balls at? Oh good, we got fan club. Nice, nice ball. Let's put out C dot. And let's do Ultra Ball. We got shift tree. We can evolve right into that next turn. And we'll fan club. Close. And we're just going to energy drive. Oh, unfortunately that shrine is going to kill me because I did not put any field blowers. Maybe I should at least clue the one, huh? Good old blaze again. It's going to be interesting. Level coin until you get heads. Oh boy. Likes, yep. Let's see what we get, guys. Oh, he's got rare candies. Oh, he's got the evolution of this guy. Interesting. What does he do? Patch up to three energies from your hand in any way you like. Oh boy. 50 damage for each head still. Okay. Well, let's do this. Get this guy out. Let's fan club. Get this out some rowlets. Set up my bench, dude. And I think uh, I might have a special now, but okay, so you like it. So we need rare candy. Everybody's gonna get shrined. Oh my word! So that's 130. So I mean, he could do 200. Jeez. What a dump sparse. Dang. That was not good. And weakness. Okay, well, here we go. That is the broken heart symbol. Okay. Really need a supporter, so let's get a Lele. That hurt. But we need to draw. We got rescue stretchers to get those back, so I'm feeling not so bad. Copycat, set six. six. I need copycats for later, so let's go on with that. We at least need a grass energy. the heck out of you. Okay. 
All right, so all we need now, guys, is double colorless and some sort of supporter that would get us. And a slugma. Not a bad deck here. I forget if he can attack the confusion, I think. Oh, yeah, that's good. He's gonna retreat. Yep. Smart. I have 210 left. Nice. Oh, that hurts. That hurts so bad. Double colorless. Okay. Now we're going to. We got a Guzma, don't we? We got a Guzma. Uh, I don't know, Lily. I hope for the best. We can always attach and retreat. Oh, bonus! Get that guy out of here. Oh, we could kill him for one thirty. Yep. Awesome. We don't want him coming back. No, no, no. Alright, good. Now we got the judge. Now we can start doing... Man, I really want to get this uh, Decidueye out so we can do some snipe damage on these low hit point guys. Let's see what he's going to do. Pretty soon, my shift tree is going to die, so we need to have a backup plan. Um... No GX and no EX, guys, in this deck is making it quite difficult. Unless he has the Blaziken GX, then... Feeling, though, he is not running it with Shrine. Oh, there it comes, Rescue Stretcher. need my Rescue Stretcher so I can... Rare King my Rallet, correct? Maybe I should include some timer balls in this deck. Hmm. Baby Blaze. Smooth over. Rare candy. <laughs> Unless he's trying to go into a room. Turns. Oh, perfect. Come on. Yes. What? Stretch. And then we are going to attach here, so in case we can do the attack. And then we are going to Oh, 
Acerola. Okay, if it doesn't hit me, I can Acerola this up. That would be awesome. at the beginning of every and end of every turn. That's not good. Well, I'm glad I saved the rescue stretcher. So let's see. Do we want to... We want to bring this up. Because if we get a double colorless, we can attack with the spatial leaf. All right, good. And then we are going to rescue stretcher. Else. And then we are going to what I really get. Let's just judge. Get a double colorless. Oh, stink. All right, but and we want rare candy. So now let's see what we can do. Next turn, we can Razor Leaf for 90. We can knock that guy out, or we can use Wonder Tag. Does not look like he's really attacking with this dude until he evolves him. So if he doesn't evolve in this turn. He did. Because we could snipe. We're going to be able to snipe twice. As you can see, guys, once this deck gets set up, I mean, it takes a little while to do so, but, um, you know, if you're doing 40 some snipe plus. 180 that's 220 um, that knocks out pretty much anybody in the format and that's only with two decidui so Let's see what we do here getting this guy ready maybe we should take that out one two three four five it's 100 but you can return that Oh, shiny art, yes. Prevent damage done to your bench. Oh, what oh, way to be. So, I guess we're gonna try to knock him out next. So now we want to put this here. Judge, and then we're gonna see what we get here. Awesome Ultra Ball. We want to hold on to that, and we're just gonna wait for it. such an idiot okay sorry guys that was totally dumb let's see what he's gonna do here he's gonna do 210 
It's got to do at least 100. This card of fire, that makes it 110. Oh, crap. That's rough. That is rough. Man, this shrine is annoying, guys. Man, the shrine is annoying. All right, well, you know what? 0 for 3. That's okay. Um, I did get some damage for my uh, my psychic um, challenge there. All right, guys. So as you can see, Decidueye, I mean, we really kind of got the short end of the stick on some of these matches with being weak to fire and so forth. But um, the basic premise of the deck is pretty good. Again, I'm still trying to tweak it, but... Um, I would definitely welcome all your comments on how I can make this deck better. I think it's a really good deck in the format. Especially when you have Shift Tree and at least two Decidueyes built up. Um, you know, it's just a matter of getting them involved quickly and seeing how that goes. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Sorry for the longer video, but I really wanted to see this deck play out and um, be able to tweak it. So, uh, have a great day. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also hit that bell icon so you can get notified when Dad is our post new videos. Have a great day.